Hello everybody, I'm Bo, and in this video I would like to talk a little bit about Albedo's neckmark. This mark can also be found on his outfit, like on his gloves or on his chest piece. Therefore, we can assume that this symbol holds some kind of significance, otherwise it wouldn't be represented so much. There is a lot of speculation surrounding the character of Albedo. In particular, the mark on his neck is the focus of a lot of theories. Some people think it's the same mark that Paimon has on her hair, which is theorized to be some kind of symbol of Celestia, whereas other people have pointed out that it is the same symbol that appears in the icon of his talent, homuncular nature, possibly indicating that Albedo may be a homunculus. First, let's briefly explain what a homunculus is. A homunculus is a concept from the theory of preformationism. This theory considered that the small, fully formed individuals existed within their germ cells. These individuals are the homunculi. The first person to ever talk about homunculus was Paracelsus in his alchemical writings. This concept was expanded in fictional writing to the idea of life creation an artificial human being created by alchemic means. However, the implications and possible consequences of Albedo being a homunculus is the subject for another theory video. I think this theory that Albedo is a homunculus is correct. I also believe that the mark on his neck supports this theory, not just because of the image of his talent, but because I think I may have found the origin of the symbol, which I believe is based on a real-life symbol. This is a drawing of a homunculus made in 1694. It is a very old drawing and a very famous one. By famous, I mean that it usually appears in science books in chapters about past theories. If you type something like homunculus drawing on Google, you will probably find it easily. This drawing represents a homunculus inside a spermatozoid. As you can see, the symbol on the head of the homunculus is the same one as on Albedo's neck. I think this drawing was probably used as an inspiration for the design of Albedo. If this is correct, that would mean that Albedo is indeed a homunculus. Finally, I would like to point out why I think Albedo's symbol and the symbol on Paimon's head are not related. If you look closely, you can see that the symbols are different. In Paimon's case, the bottom arm of the four-pointed star is longer than the rest, making the arms on the side to be closer to the top one. That is not the case in Albedo's mark, whose top and bottom halves are symmetrical. I think Paimon's symbol is supposed to be a star or a meteorite falling representing Celestia, and the similarities with Albedo's mark are just a coincidence. That was all I wanted to present today, just a short little video. I hope it was entertaining, let me know what you think. Bye!